we are also having this thing developing up of these lorries along Bukembe, along Kandui. Governor, I don't know what we are going to do, but we need to find a place to get all these lorries off the main highway. Because if you pass there around 10, 11, you will not really be very, very happy. You'll find very young kids, you know, very young kids trying to walk around. You will find even at night, small kids, unakuta mtoto waka na beba ndizi usiku, anaingia kwa ba. Ama waka anatembeza bado njugu kwa barabara usiku. I think let's clamp up on this. And we can talk on and on and on. But we have a greater potential which we need to exploit. We are going to make sure that with our bursaries, we are going to help you have those bright students remain in school so that they can be able to perform quite well. And I want to insist on the bright students because there is no need to give bursary animals and yet those are the people who are going to get is. That's how you know that there is no difference. Because what you eat means Unaweza kaa tu nyumbani na ukuje uandike jina na uende upate E. But you have been in school for four years na bado natoka na hiyo E, then there is a problem. The big thing about all these things we are trying to discuss is funding. Is funding. Is the government committed or not? And where I sit, we we'll put Machogu on task. I think the government is not serious. And I urge my colleagues that when we go back to parliament, we must be more tougher to one CS Machogo and the Treasury. Because they have been telling us we are releasing capitation. We are releasing capitation. They're not. These head teachers are hardly working with 30% of what they are supposed to get. That have done very well are the day schools that have managed how to send the students away to look for fees very well. The schools whose children are always on road, they have been the last ones. Yeah? So we appreciate that we are in some kind of a, an economic turmoil, an economic crisis in our country. So when you are a principal of a school, if in seven days in a week, your children are in class, only for two hours. Do you expect them to pass the exams? They don't. So you must find a way on how you are going to navigate 